This question seven is about circle theorems. Um, we can do this a few different ways, but I think uh, possibly the easiest way is looking at this angle first. We need to find angle heck x here, so we need to find the other two angles. So I'm going to find this one first, and this one is 46 degrees because it's alternate segment theorem. So that is uh, DCE, DCE equals 46 degrees. It doesn't ask for reasons, as it does a lot in GCSE, so we don't need to put them. But that's what it is, alternate segment. Now let's have a look at this one here. That is ADC. ADC equals, now this here, we have a quadrilateral inside the circle, so opposite angles in a cyclic quadrilateral add up to 180 degrees. So we've got this one here, 46 and 37, adds up to 83, and as I said, that these add up to 180 degrees, so it's 180 minus 83. And we get 97 degrees. Now, that's uh, 97. This is just angles on a straight line now. So let's see. CDE. CDE equals 180 minus 97. Angles on a straight line, which is 83 degrees. 83 there. Now we have two of the angles of the triangle and angles in a triangle add up to 180 degrees so we've got CED CED or in this case X equals 180 minus 46 minus 83 and X equals 51 degrees that's it